calculus, this is the practice assessment for topic four. And this is the first set of uh, prove the identity problems on the first page. And we're just going to do these identities. So a um, couple different tools when doing the identities. One of them is just rewrite everything in terms of sine and cosine. So I know that cosecant is one over sine. And I know that tangent is sine over cosine. And I'm going to try and manipulate this and get it to be secant. And I notice uh, conveniently that sine divided by sine is 1, so I have 1 over cosine, which, uh, which is secant. And that one's proved. Proven. All right, let's do this next one. Um, cosecant squared times, I'm sorry, cosine squared times cosecant times secant equals cotangent. So let's see, this is already in terms of cosine. Cosecant is 1 over sine. If you think about this, this is just cosine squared over 1. And secant, these are arrows here, is uh, 1 over cosine. Let me try and manipulate this to make it a cotangent. I notice that uh, this cosine would divide out one of those cosines, right? This is cosine times cosine. So now what's left is cosine times 1 on the top, sine times 1 on the bottom. Um, so it's cosine over sine which is cotan, and that one's proven. All right, next one. Uh, tangent is secant over cosecant. I'm going to manipulate this, this right-hand side. So I'm going to think of uh, what secant is. Secant is 1 over cosine, and cosecant is 1 over sine. So I notice I have a fraction divided by another fraction. Notice that this is... Uh, this means 1 over cosine divided by 1 over sine. And I know when I divide by a fraction, I can take the reciprocal and multiply it. So this is the same as 1 over cosine times uh, sine over 1, which is sine over cosine, which is tangent. And there's those uh, first three proven.